to learn the script and stuff but I just washed my face and brushed my teeth and the next thing I'm going to do is my skincare routine I don't really use too many products because my skin reacts to them very very bad and I don't want to risk it especially before a casting call like this not gonna happen something I started using three days ago is this serum here it's like a multi moisture serum I am obsessed with it also, I love those products that come with this thingy here. It makes me feel like a beauty guru and like um, in those Vogue videos where celebrities show their makeup routine. I just feel a little bit more fancy. I just work it into my skin. It's time for makeup. I usually do not wear a lot of makeup to castings. I just use it to enhance certain futures I have and um, we're gonna work with it today. <laughs> I use this styling wax here for my brows. Um, you can use it for anything to be honest. I just go in with the spoolie and I just brush through my brows. I think it makes a huge difference. And even if you don't notice it, I know that I just like brush through my brows and that's enough for me. I don't need you to tell me I look pretty. Brows are done. Next thing I use is this powder foundation. It says Hello Happy and it's in the color 10. It really matches my skin tone. The only thing I do is go under my eyes so I can get rid of the dark circles I have because I cried yesterday. Maybe you guys will find out why I cried in the video before this one or in future videos. I feel like it's a good video to post. But I'm not sure if I'm willing to get this vulnerable with the internet yet, so. I think it's well blended now, so. Next thing we're doing is blush. I use a cream blush. People also use powder blushes. I like cream blushes better because you can work with them a little better. Lipstick. <laughs> On our way to the casting, I still had to study the script because I didn't get to do so the past two days because I was super, super busy with school. Eventually, I did it. But I have to admit, I was getting distracted by the beautiful trees and the fall colors. Can we just appreciate it? the casting we finally got ourselves some food and I really just sat down at the bench by myself and started eating because at this point I was tired and hungry and we don't want that combination so this is how I solved my problem this was also my outfit for the casting I made sure to show my personality through my outfit as well and this is how I felt and I really really love everything about my outfit choice for the casting Rushing to the subway now. Oh lord, come on. I hate having to run. The journey home was very peaceful, especially because we went home by train. It was very calming after such a hectic day to not be in control of one thing and just sit there and just relax for at least 20 minutes before getting home. morning friends it's a new day and i'm having breakfast right now i have such a glorious breakfast and after that i'm gonna get my journal out and reflect on yesterday 
And I think it's very important to write such things down because you forget about them very easily. As well as in the future, I might be telling people my story and I think it's good to have it in detail. I'm getting more comfortable with being uncomfortable because castings in this whole environment, the things people want you to do at castings might make you uncomfortable because it's not an everyday thing, you know? So, you know, being in a room full of people who are aiming for the same thing as you, who see you as concurrents, you know? That can make a situation very uncomfortable. There's always a lot of small talk going on at castings. Everyone's giving you their best fake smile and everyone's on edge and hungry, just using like their last bits of energy to get the role. So no, it's not easy, but yes, it's a lot of fun and the experience at the end is always a story to tell. It's so beautiful and I love it. Guys, I just found out that I'm going to be the main character. So overwhelmed at this point. This is like so crazy. It's like good news and I really am so grateful for every opportunity I get. Considering the fact that it was my first ever audition for such a big project and I immediately got it. <laughs> I'm so happy. I could cry now because I was worrying so much. Um, basically, there was a second round. I was invited to another casting. Um, so they wanted to see me again. So there was like a recall. Basically, that was just us acting out another script with other partners. So basically, last time, the first casting, the one I took you guys with me, was with like a lot of people. And that was like a real challenge, but I killed it, of course. And that's already it with the video. If you guys want more videos on a topic of acting, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and comment down your questions. I can answer those in a video and take you guys with me on set. It would be so much fun to do so. To get to know me a little bit better and see a little bit of my day-to-day -day life, make sure to follow me on my Instagram. I take you guys with me on my stories. I post there. And it's just a safe place for everyone, no matter if you're interested in acting or not. And I love you guys so much. See you guys next time. Bye!